in this GPT era, people who know how to use GPT-4, ChatGPT can 100x more productive than those who don't. And this video will show the evidence of this claim. I know it's a big claim. I know a lot of people saying that GPT-4 couldn't finish a task based on a high level goal. You need to interact with GPT-4 for so many times. Hence, it couldn't replace humans on a large scale. I want to show you a tool that you can use and they can immediately just give the GPT-4, chat GPT a very high level goal. For example, find me top five cheapest bicycles for camping or do me a podcast research for machine learning topics or write me a Twitter sh thread about chat GPT or about auto GPT. This kind of thing is a very high level goal. It, ordinarily, um, GPT couldn't finish this task on one go. You need a lot of iteration. I'm going to show you in this video. And you don't want to miss it if you want to increase your productivity, if you want to learn more about like the future research directions, because I think the future of um, research is about staking chat GPT, GPT-4 to let it finish the task based on very high level goal is just like you are a product manager, project manager, tell the engineers to do things and they will do things for you. Before we dive in, if you really like this video, don't forget to support this channel by subscribing it, giving more motivation to make more videos like this. Let's go. Agent GPT, it's a continuation of uh, Auto GPT. Auto GPT is a very great tool that allows you to do a lot of things like just give you a high level goal and Agent GPT gives you fancier UI that you don't have to do this in the terminal anymore. So for example, I'm just going to show you uh, Agent GPT, <sighs> what Agent GPT can do. For example, I wanted to write a Twitter thread about Agent GPT. So if you just ask ChatGPT, this ChatGPT won't be able to answer you because ChatGPT doesn't even know what Agent GPT is because it's come out, it came out after ChatGPT, GPT-4. And even you just want to ask it, it won't be able to generate a Twitter thread, a good Twitter thread in one go. So what this Agent GPT, Auto GPT do is to break down your high level goal to multiple different tasks and then uh, achieve this different task by stage. So you will achieve the task number one and then use the task number one's result to perform task number two. So first of all, it will break down your high level goal. Write a Twitter thread about Agent GBT. So it's, it's, we just uh, started to run, thinking, thinking, thinking. Then you will you break down. So there are three tasks. The first one is analyze recent tweets about AI and extract relevant information to include in the thread. That's very reasonable, right? You need to get a recent recent tweets about uh oh agent GBT. Um the problem is I think you should add some keyword agent GBT here is better because I know it's going to run Google search engine. Um which I would explain the under like uh, under the who the inner working of this uh, using auto GBT is a better um, it's a better tool to understand how it works. Okay so the second task is gener it will generate a list of uh, key features and the benefits of Agent GPT, which is very key. You need to know what the kind of things that Agent GPT can do so that you can write a very fancy, uh, attractive Twitter thread, right? Such as its capability to generate high quality content and improve productivity, which is true. And task three, which is last task, then use natural language processing to write the engaging information, informative tweets. They highlight the unique advantage of Agent GPT from the, the data that we got from previous two tasks, right? And also position it as a valuable tool for business and individual alike, then so that you will have more uh, views. So the task one is easy and it analyze basic, any, analyze the things like, oh, this is a very, very good thing. Analyze the tweeters. It's amazing. If you're very interested, look into auto GPT's call because agent GPT is basic as a fancy UI of auto GPT. Okay, so it kind of did a lot of research. It, get a lot of data from Google. And you should just call a, uh, do a search, Google search to search some tweets from Google. So task mask is complete. Then the second task, it generates a list of a key feature. So while the key features stay of Agent GPT is can do content generation, improve productivity, which is all true, and customization and language support, many different languages, which is all true about Agent GPT. So it get a lot of data from Google, it crawl a lot of data for you, and it analyze. And if you just write, write a <laughs> crawler yourself, you it's very hard to parse the result. And Agent GPT would just basically parse the result for you. Uh, and actually, I wanted to do these kind of things before, like a few weeks ago, and then they did this already. So it's 
Hassan. And task three is to use the natural language to write a Twitter thread. So what this is, they like just started to write a Twitter thread, right? Let's see if this is a good thread. Introducing agent GPT, the cutting edge AI tool, they can revolutionize your business with its seamless task execution. With uh, natural language processing, Agent GPT can write engaging content for your brand and keep your social media game on point. Plus, it's a valuable tool for individuals looking for the optimization, blah blah. And GPT really wants to 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 add these kind of hashtags, which I don't like. So it, it says it's complete, but I don't know why it runs task three again. Sometimes it will just keep running the task until it's complete. It will have some some stopping criteria, but we don't know. Uh, by just looking at agent GPT. And you guys say this is a thread, but probably so this is a long thread. Uh, let's just uh, something worry about uh, da data privacy. Agent GPT is designed to s with security mind, which I don't know if it's true because it just called it uh, chat GPT API. In summary, agent GPT is a very good tool or something, blah, blah, blah. So it finished the thread. So how amazing it is. It, break, it broke this uh, high level goal down into three different tasks and implement these uh, three different tasks by stage. This is awesome. Okay, so if you want to use this, it's super, super simple. Agent GPT. Uh, the store is already 7,000. It's just a release four days ago. Um, it's super, super easy. You just follow this, how to do, you just run this. Basically, you just run, follow the whole things. Then I actually did a manual setup, follow all this, and you can know. Okay, so now I want to demo you Auto GPT, which is uh, the parent uh, of uh, Agent. So it was released two weeks ago, and now it kind of exponentially exploded to for over 40,000 stars. I have never seen something like this. This AI era is crazy. So um, that's why I say, if you know this kind of tool, your productivity, do you think your productivity will be the same as the people who don't know this? I think at least like 10x. And if you use it properly, you could be 100x. It's not like ex exaggerated. It's a very crazy thing. If you don't know this, you're kind of far, far behind. And it's now it's like not many people really know how to use these tools, even including me. That's why I'm kind of, kind of researching a lot of this to keep myself on top. Not just research part, also productivity part. Okay, so let's just run these things, right? Agent auto GBT on the terminal. So it will just ask, I already set out the goals for you. Create an interesting tweet about auto GBT. Grow, the goal is to grow my Twitter account, increase the Twitter followers, okay? So you can just let it run. And uh, you can actually even have memory if you give it some kind of cache, like a database. You can just restore your memory. Okay, so now it's kind of got a lot of things to you. Let's start by researching some interesting topics like that, blah, blah, blah. And uh, you will keep looking, lo looping like this. Then you can give it comments. So you would do the Google search. Like as you say, like I just said earlier, you could just do Google search. And this is Google search like result. You crawl the Google search. You get your code Google search API. Uh, which is free. It's free for you. This can put your own Google API key, so you can do more crawling, and uh, you will auto like can kind of uh, do YouTube video <laughs> research thoughts. I don't know because the previous one I did the YouTube video research thoughts. So you have thoughts on this based on your you Google search. We found something interesting related to AutoGPT. Let's use a G GPT agent to create some tweets based on our inspiration. So it's basically say. It's what I'm doing now, but I wasn't looking at this, I promise. It just generates something almost exactly the same as what I'm doing now. So by using a GPT agent to write our tweets, we save time and uh, well, we can kind of give feedback on something interesting and engaging. Of course, that's what I'm doing, but I wasn't uh, inspired by this. And this plan, you have plans to start a GPT agent and auto GPT Twitter and then use the uh, message tweet agent's comment to provide a prompt and Twitter and tweets that we want to post. The agent will generate tweets automatically based on the prompt we provided. We will review the choice. We will review and choose the best tweets to post the Twitter account. Post tweets manually to our uh, Twitter account. All right, so criticism, you also have its criticism to itself. We need to ensure the prompts are provided to the GPT agents are descriptive enough to create the post. So let's just see. We can let agent start, start comment. Let's see what will happen. I think the problem with this uh, auto GPT is, is quite slow. I don't know why agent GPT is much faster, but you have far more control of this because you know like the state by state things. And the final one problem is it will 
took would take many 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 rounds to finish one task and i'm very impatient sometimes it takes like 30 rounds and also gpt agent gpt is a, there's some modification it just runs faster it doesn't run that many times you maybe have less perfect result but you at least have a result right and this you can you can actually let it run so many uh times like they say it runs three rounds at once so you i don't have to enter wise for so many times all right, so uh, we are not going to wait for this generate. But that's the things I want to tell you today. Um, this kind of tools is getting crazy. The current very, very, very promising research direction is to kind of, kind of how to use, how to direct these kind of multiple GBT agents to let, them, let themselves to talk to each other to finish your task. So there are a lot of ways you can let a GBT to self-reflect or self-correct and self-talk, many, many different ways to do it. This is a very, very interesting demand of research. And I believe we just started this kind of field for like three weeks. And imagine one year, two years down the line, they can do so much, much better. They will definitely replace a lot of humans in the workplace. World, world there will be a scary thing and also exciting thing at the same time. And if you're researching, I definitely encourage you to look into more things like this. If you're like an individual user, you just want a, uh, your hacker, this is very awesome productivity tools. You can use this to write so many different things, even code. So uh, there's such a kind of a very interesting topic. I, I will kind of, kind of cover more of this down the line. I uh, will make more videos about this. So if you really like the kind of videos, uh, definitely give me a subscribe and share, like these videos to your friends, share to your friends, anything like that. So that give me more motivation to make videos like this. Other than that, enjoy your chat GBD and I'll probably post these tweets on my Twitter and also follow my tweet, Twitter account. It's like Deep Learning Explainer, very straightforward. Thank you very much. Enjoy your day and I will see you.